What is septic shock? When your body battles an infection too hard hey definers. Welcome back to Define Channel, where we take complex topics and break them down into bite-sized chunks of knowledge. Today, we're diving into the world of medicine to understand a life-threatening condition called septic shock. It's a scary term, but don't worry, we'll unravel it layer by layer so you can walk away feeling informed and empowered. Imagine your body as a well-oiled machine. Usually, when an uninvited guest like a bacterial infection shows up, your immune system kicks into high gear, sending out its white blood cell soldiers to fight back. This is a good thing. But sometimes, this response gets a little out of control, like an overzealous overlord leading his troops into a chaotic frenzy. This is where things get dangerous, and the battlefield becomes your own body. This, my friends, is sepsis. Sepsis is essentially your body's overreaction to an infection. It's like your immune system throws a grand party with fireworks and loud music, except in this case, the fireworks ignite your tissues and the music disrupts your organs' rhythm. This internal chaos leads to widespread inflammation, causing body fluids to leak into the wrong places, blood pressure to plummet, and organs to struggle to function properly. This is sepsis in a nutshell. A storm inside your body triggered by an unwelcome guest. Now, if sepsis is the storm, septic shock is the hurricane. It's the most severe complication of sepsis, where the blood pressure drop becomes so extreme that your organs start getting starved of oxygen and nutrients. Imagine the chaos of sepsis amplified tenfold, with vital organs like your lungs, kidneys, and liver gasping for air unable to keep up with their essential tasks. This is when the fight against infection becomes a fight for survival. So, who's at risk for this scary storm? The answer, unfortunately, is anyone. While young and healthy individuals can bounce back from infections, people with weakened immune systems, chronic illnesses, or invasive medical procedures are more vulnerable to developing sepsis and, eventually, septic shock. Common infections like pneumonia, urinary tract infections, or even a simple skin infection can turn into this life-threatening condition. So, what are the warning signs? Remember, early detection is key in the battle against septic shock. Keep an eye out for these red flags, fever or chills, your body's alarm bells ringing, rapid heartbeat and breathing, your body struggling to get enough oxygen, confusion or changes in mental state, the storm affecting your brain. Severe pain or discomfort. Your body crying out for help. Low blood pressure or clammy skin. Your organs struggling to stay afloat. If you notice any of these symptoms, especially after an infection, seek immediate medical attention. Septic shock is a time-sensitive emergency, and every minute counts. Doctors will act quickly with antibiotics, fluids, and supportive care to stabilize your body and fight the infection. Remember, sepsis and septic shock are serious, but not invincible. By staying informed, recognizing the warning signs, and seeking timely medical help, you can become a proactive player in your health. Don't forget to share this knowledge with your loved ones, because awareness is the first line of defense. So, definers, let's take a stand against septic shock. Click that subscribe button to stay tuned for more informative content. Hit that like button if you found this video helpful, and share it with your friends and family to spread the word. Together, we can define health and fight for a brighter future. This is just a starting point. Feel free to expand on each section with examples, real-life stories, and even animations or visuals to make the content more engaging for your student audience. Remember to keep the language clear, concise, and avoid overly technical jargon. I hope this helps you create an informative and impactful video about septic shock.